Uh, I think it's the fifth time you come back from uh, two sets down uh, in a slam. Uh, and uh, uh, I was thinking about you when you were 19 or 18 years old. Uh, sometimes you were struggling physically too. I mean, I remember you had to retire some sometimes. Do you think uh, uh, that to be physically strong to play five sets, you need to be 25? 24. I mean, you, you need to have some years before you can make it. And now uh, I also have to ask you, I'm sorry about Berrettini, who is your next opponent, because I don't know if someone yeah. would ask you. Um, <clears throat> yes, you're right. I mean, at the beginning of my career, I was also struggling with injuries and I had to retire, you know, a few matches at the Grand Slams at the, at the beginning of my professional career. And uh, that's that's obviously not fun, you know. It's not uh, uh, something that you you know desire to experience uh, as a young player. But uh, look, Musetti won uh, five sets against Cecchinato last round, so it's it's not like it's uh, it's the first time that he's playing f f five five sets. I mean, he came off the five sets first time in fourth round. You know, it's it's a mix between you know uh, emotions and uh, kind of an excitement, but at the same time the pressure of n not knowing how he's going to feel playing first time on the center court uh, against the top player. You know, it's it's a new experience. A new experience can uh, go go both ways. It can give you really a boost of uh, energy and strength, and because uh, you have nothing to lose. But at the same time, it can take away a lot because you, as a youngster, you still maybe, um, you know, are, are still uh, developing your uh, abilities to to mentally and emotionally cope with this kind of, uh, uh, you know, uh, pressures and expectations and excitement. You know, it 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 draws a lot of energy out of a player. So. Uh, at the beginning, for young young guys, it's it still takes some time to you have to experience in order to to learn how to deal with it the next time. So, the experience is the best teacher, and uh, you know Musetti has uh, definitely all the uh, qualities in his tennis uh, in his game on clay, particularly, but also other surfaces to be a top player. I wish him all the best. He's a nice guy. We, we know each other well now. We've trained uh, quite, a, quite, a, quite a bit, uh, and now we played for the first time. So, yeah, I, I really wish him all the best. I think uh, if he if he keeps going in this way, he's he's definitely on the right path to to become a top player one day. And Berrettini, uh, Berrettini, uh, another Italian guy. I'm sure you'll be happy to see that match, Ubaldo, as well. Uh, big serve. Uh, big forehand, you know, two big weapons. He he's uh, in form. Uh, you know, he, he has uh, finished the last year very strong. He started this year strong as well, beating, you know, Dominic Team uh, in in Australia, playing really good ATP Cup, reaching final, reaching the finals of ATP Cup with Italy, um, and uh, you know, he just has so much firepower in his. Uh, in his game, and you wrote drop shot to Baldo. Yes, also drop shot is pretty good. <laughs> he's very aggressive, you know, with this big serve. He's got a lot of, um, let's say, easier balls in the middle of the court that he can penetrate with the forehand or he can drop shot. He's very good at the net. Just uh, he's a top 10 player, you know, for the last couple of years. And uh, right now, quarterfinals of a slam, you know, uh, you need to be at your best in order to, to have a chance to win.